Hi guys, welcome to another product review with GuitarIngenuity.com. So, I bought myself the Woody SC uh, by Seymour Duncan. And I think Woody SC, the SC stands for single coil. Now here's something interesting that happened. Give me one second, I dropped that little piece here. I was looking for a pickup for my acoustic guitar, for my classical guitar, uh, to be more precise, the Yamaha C40, which I recently bought, and I thought it would be nice to have it um, amplified um, via my Ma Marshall amp. So I thought, oh, okay, I'm going to get myself a decent pickup, and um, I went on Amazon and I found the Woody SC, right? Now, I bought it, and to my surprise, there were two problems. First of all, the pickup did not fit. This is actually, this is the pickup. It comes with a long cable, and I show you everything in the detail when we go downstairs to my office where I have my amp and then I will give you a little um, a sample of how it sounds and it's phenomenal by the way. But let me finish your story first. So I got myself the pickup and you get, and guess what? It didn't fit on the sound hole of my acoustic guitar. It's just too big. There's no way to squeeze that in. So I thought, oh, that's a bummer. And I actually, stupidly started to or or I took off a little piece of wood here on the on the on the back side so to make it fit now after I had that done I hooked it up to my amplifier again we're talking about my classical guitar hooked up to the amplifier and nothing happened so two mistakes first mistake the woody is not designed as a pickup for guitars with nylon strings. So any classical guitars, the Woody will not work. At least I didn't get it to work. Maybe there's a way to modify it so it will work, but I wasn't able to do that. Because um, it is specifically designed for steel string guitars, and it clearly says that on the package and it says it in the in the product description, so I just didn't pay attention. So again, the Woody only works with steel string acoustic guitars, number one. Secondly, very important, the sound hole has to be a specific size. Anything uh, that doesn't, any sound hole that doesn't fit in that particular range here, which is 9.75 inches to 4 inches, will not work. So measure the sound hole of your guitar and then make sure that it's compatible or the Woody is compatible to your guitar. So other than that, after I figured all that out, I thought, okay, so what I'm going to do with that thing now? Well, I do have an acoustic guitar with steel strings. Now, this is a Japanese model, uh, Takamine, or I think you say ta Takamine here. Um, but the, the thing is, it doesn't need um, a, a pickup because it has an integrated pickup. However, just for demonstration purposes, what we're going to do now is we're going to go downstairs and I show you how to put the Seymour Duncan SC Woody on a acoustic guitar which has the proper sound hole size and um, it has steel strings, obviously, and I'm, we're going to hook it up to the amp and I'll give you a little sound sa sample just playing a couple of tunes so um, you hear the fabulous quality of that product. I'm really amazed. It's actually, it's better than the integrated pickup. Um, it's, it's really remarkable. So definitely a good deal. And uh, let's go downstairs and I'll show you exactly uh, how, it, how you put it on your guitar and how it sounds, okay? One second. Hey there, so we're now downstairs in my office and I apologize a little bit for the mess here. This is not my typical recording area, but I have my amp here and my other guitars. So as promised, I wanted to give you uh, a quick demo on the Seymour Duncan Woody SC pickup 
and um, I just wanted to show you how easy it is to put on your guitar and get started. So uh, first of all, as discussed, the whole thing comes in this um, very chic bag here. Here it says Woody. It comes with an owner's manual, which you really don't need necessarily if you pay attention to uh, if you paid attention to what I mentioned in the beginning of this video with regard to the size of the sound hole and the fact that you should use the pickup along with guitars that have steel strings. So what we're going to do now is we're going to install the pickup on the guitar and the way to do that is fairly simple. So I hope you see that well on camera. You basically just put it here in the sound hole and then you just wedge it in right here so that it's not in your way. Now with that being said sometimes it might make sense to kind of tape the wire here so that it doesn't uh, um, you know wiggle around all over the place but uh, that's really it. That's really all as far as the installation is concerned. Now, I told you, I unfortunately cut a little piece of wood out on the backside. Otherwise, the grip here would be firmer. Um, but uh, it is what it is. So I have to live with, um, with my modified version now. So the, the amp is turned on. Let me just increase the volume a little bit. So I hope you hear it over my microphone right now. This is the sound of the Woody Seymour Duncan SC pickup connected through a Marshall amp. Let me play string by string. So those are new strings. They are pretty much in tune but so you see it's a really warm, nice, distinct and clear sound. So I was really surprised and positively surprised um, to, to hear that type of sound. You see, this is now obviously the clean channel. You can even um, get some some sustain on it. I don't want to do that right now because I get a weird feedback in here and in this room because it's really everything is very narrow. Uh, just let me play some random stuff. see um, again as I just mentioned a very nice sound warm rich yet distinct not um, sometimes it, it sounds like um, you're playing you're sitting in a in a, a tin can and it has this really metally weird sound depending on the pickup you use not with the uh, Seymour Duncan SC Woody. So I'm extremely satisfied with the product even though I have to use it on the guitar now that actually would not need um, a pickup because it's already equipped with one. 
with an integrated version but nonetheless I mean I really prefer that little thing and I'm extremely satisfied with my purchase I think it was around $35 the cable is 14 feet long so that gives you enough room to roam around on stage so that's another nice feature I think that's really all I can say to it you see it's it's just you put it on the sound hole um, you hook it up to your amp and you're good to go that's that's really all that there is to it so again it comes highly recommended um, get your get your hands on it there's a link on my site you can buy it through there and if you have any questions around this product or any other guitar related questions um, send me an email at guitaringenuity at gmx.com. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.